What's up, everybody? Yeah, it's a beautiful day out. I wanted to uh, jump on here. Just got back and noticed that uh, the mail did come in today. So I figured I'd do a mail call. This mail is from uh, Drone Life. So what I'll do is, being it's such a beautiful day out, wanted to do it right here. And uh, I did try to give him a call before I did the video. <laughs> um, let him know that uh, I did get mail in uh, from him today. So uh, I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. It's so beautiful out. And uh, I do have mail, like I say. So I'm going to try doing this one-handed to open this up. Let's see how good I am one-handed. Probably not the greatest. So I'm going to make a look at the tree for a second as I try to pull this back. Yeah. Doing this elbow and hand. <laughs> See, one person's on. Thank you very much for coming on, whoever's on. So, let's see what's in here. Oh, man. Oh, ho, ho. Well, my drones, how are you doing, buddy? Yeah, I know. I need to make a hat cam for sure. 68 Corvette. This is the Gas Monkeys Corvette. Man, look at that sparkle. That gold metallic flake in that car. Free those hands up. Doing good, brother. That's a good thing. I know it. Oh, man. This one I've been looking for, too. I wonder where the heck he found this one at. This is sweet. That's a nice color, too. I always like that color on a Corvette. It does stand out really nice. This is from Drone Life. I got the package in today. Drone Life, thank you so much, buddy. Man, this is, and you can tell ever since I had that bad storm, my phone's been going all haywire with its focus. It must have really messed it up when I was out in that storm. <laughs> Man, this is so cool. Gas Monkey Garage. And if anybody hasn't watched that show, definitely look that show up. It's really cool to watch. Gas Monkey Garage. Man, this is a sweet one, too. Oh, the back is taking off on me. A little breezy out. But yeah, that's, I mean, just that color itself is. It'll, it'll show up. Man, that's really a nice coloration. Gas Monkey Garage. That car is so cool. Jim's Equipment. GMC still on the air? I don't know. I've I've, uh, I've always looked to see if I've uh, been able to find that show. I mean, I watch reruns of it, but that's that's about it. Oh, but, oh man. The other car is sweet. Man, I didn't know they had this one. I only knew of the gold-colored Gas Monkey Garage car. Look at that sucker. Chris, I thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Man, that is so sweet. As you can see, it says Gas Monkey up on top. 50th anniversary cars are out. I do have those cars. Man, if my phone wasn't so haywire with its focus since the storm. That is sweet. It's got a metallic blue with the flames on that one. That one is so cool. You can hear all the birds and stuff. <laughs> oh. but yeah, there's these are both uh, both vehicles from Gas Monkey Garage. These are from Drone Life. Man, these are so cool. Drone Life, if you're watching, thank you very much for these cars. These are going right up next to the other ones I have on the wall already. Both of those will be awesome in your collection. Yes, definitely. Hi, drone review man. Yes, indeed. This is a good, uh, good mail call. These are the Gas Monkey Garage cars from Hot Wheels. See, I've only known a, 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 just the gold metallic one, and not the uh, the blue metallic with the flames onto it. So, man, this is one hell of a find. Yeah, these would definitely be one hell of uh, addition to the collection right there. Wakey RC, hey, only Paul, what's up, buddy? How are you doing today, man? Yeah, so these are these are from Drone Life. Chris, thank you very much. Holy crap. As soon as I saw the, the gold car, I didn't see the, the other one at first, and I just saw the gold one. It's like, oh, man. Then I saw that blue one with the flames onto it about... How does she talk to mushroom? 
But I, I, oh man, that means a lot. Thank you very much, guys. Every, every time somebody sends me a car like this, it's it, even though they are, these are really awesome. I like find out where the heck he find these two. Damn. And he said it was a secret package. Now I see why. I'm like, holy cow. Uh, well, these were um from 2017, as you see on the back of the package here. Um, we're both the 68 Corvettes. These come out after, shortly after the, uh, uh, the show. And I know that they were doing these for that. Uh, our boy Tomoto. Hey buddy, how are you doing? Heath, buddy. How are you doing today, man? And I loved your, uh, your video. You guys were looking like you had fun. I, like I was saying in the video, I wasn't sure who had more fun, the dogs or you. So they were both look like they were having fun. <laughs> But yeah, those are those are definitely part of the the collection that were really good. Uh oh, Taryn, gonna start mowing lawn. Are you are you mowing lawn? Maybe, or are you just out there having fun? Thank you very much, Arrow Boy Toe. Those are definitely going in the collection. You gotta, you gotta put it. Uh, you gotta choke. You gotta, you gotta choke it for a second. Hold on. You got her. Oh, uh, see, see, she can get it going. <laughs> All right, now bring the throttle down. She don't know how to unchoke it. Hold on. You gotta unchoke it. Yeah, after it starts like that, then you gotta unchoke it. There you go. <laughs> you might not be heavy enough for the seat. No. Are you sure? You got to be on the seat because what happens is it's got a kill switch in the seat. <laughs> I think she gets it. Oh no, she knows how to turn it on. Oh, the other way. Backwards. Oh boy, I don't know if she's going to run anything over. Now, if her mother knows, I hope she does, because uh, if not, I have no part in this whatsoever. <laughs> Does your mother know you're mowing? Does your mother know you're mowing? Mother know you're mowing. What are you doing on the mower then? You might want to put it back so you don't get so you don't get in trouble. Here, you hold on to this. All right, turn it this way. Alright, now back it in. Back it in. Oh boy. You can back it in. This is a good thing I asked because uh, <laughs> her mother didn't know about it. Turn the wheel the other way. All right, now straighten it out. Turn it the other way now. Oh boy. Yeah, turn a little bit more. Turn it. Okay, right there. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That way you don't get in trouble. That, my friends, is how you make sure that no parents get yelled or yelling. <laughs> Your mother found out she would have whooped it. I'm back, guys. How are we doing? <laughs> you 
I know you were trying to do something nice and you were going to mow the lawn, but at least that way you don't get in trouble. She doesn't I'll know. Ask her. Yes. She'll probably want you to wait until she gets home. Probably. Yeah, as you can tell, I, I did get the sandpaper and stuff. Uh, so I will be uh, sanding the rest of this down, though. She's just trying to do some chores. Yeah, she was trying to do some, but uh, <laughs> your job? No, you, well, I already mowed all my section. Did a lot of mowing already. My daughter just got home on the late bus. Um, can I mow the lawn? Why? Why? You say hi. I'm outside. Mm. Cause I'm I'm live. Hi. You say hi. <laughs> Sophia Passion, how are you doing? Emmy's 509. Thank you very much for coming in. She said no. Everyone's doing well. Yeah, see, your mother said no. None of your Oh, yeah. Well, she she has to take about half uh, 30 yards of a football field to get her foot to hit the, the breakdown so she can turn it on. Roger, buddy. What's up, buddy? Legendary Explorer. Thank you very much for coming in. I was have to show you guys what uh, mail call was today. I got it from uh, from uh, Drone Life. I got both of the uh, Grease Monkey uh, Corvette 68 Corvette. See, I only knew of this one, uh, the gold metallic flake one. I did not know of this one here, um, the go the the blue metallic flake one with the flames onto it. Beautiful cars. Thank you very much, guys. She needs wooden blocks. I know, and I was like, I'm gonna have to build her something so that way she can uh, she can mow the lawn. <laughs> yeah, I went to the doctor today finally for my uh, my big toe on my uh, left foot, and uh, it's not gout. Um, uh, he's kind of going towards uh, uh, maybe arthritis in the toe, but uh, I got paperwork. I got to go and have it X-rayed sometime. 2004 yeah. Army Humvee diecast yeah. model car. Oh, that's cool, legendary. Adding that to your collection. Put it into your videos. <laughs> what are you guys doing? <laughs> but yeah, um, once I get this all done here. Yeah, I, he was like, no, he, he, if it was, uh, he said. Um, if it was swollen really bad, lots of redness to it, I said, no, I never, nothing like that or anything. I just got major pain to it. I'm going to put the Humvee in my military collection. There you go, bud. They're on live. Hey, buddy. I appreciate it, bud. Oh, my God. You know, those, I, and now I see why you were saying it was a secret package. That thing, those cars were cool. And, and the cool thing was... I only knew of just the uh, the gold metallic um, uh, grease monkey car. I didn't know about the um, the metallic flame one. That one was really cool. I thank you so much, bud. You know, that was a shocker. That was definitely a shocker. And the funny thing was, the wife goes, I know what you got. And I'm like, oh, that's really no fair. <laughs> oh, you were flying your Phantom. Oh, I do apologize. I hope I didn't screw it up while you were, you were flying, bud. Heath, I hope everything's been going well, bud. Uh, I know it's been hectic and everything. What are you doing, Squirt? <laughs> oh, it's been uh, it's been pretty good up here. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't. Oh, you did set up your account. Yeah, so I can go live now. Oh, cool. Because you do it. Yeah, you can do it off your phone. I don't have a phone. Oh, that's right. You got your phone taken away from you. <laughs> How's the weather up by you there, Roger and Kim? Four hours before I could. Oh, okay, very windy up there. I know, no, 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 no. I know. I still gotta sand it, honey. What sand it? I gotta sand. Like, so see how it's smoother. So it's smooth. Yeah, I'm sanding it up here so that way it's that way it's not as rough. I was going to ask about the weather. It's yeah, the weather and um, okay, I know we're supposed to be, we're supposed to get like 80 degree weather sh uh, sometime, but uh, windy but sunny, about 48. 
Now, I wish your weather was a lot better for you there, Emmy. Ours was like that not too long ago, except for ours dropped down to like 38 or something like that two weeks ago when we had snow. No, I'm going to get that next week. Um, being I had to get the, the fuel pump and everything uh, and more parts, I got to get that lower ball joint ordered from Rock Auto and everything. That kind of uh, everything's kind of tight right now with the way that damn thing is basically tooth and nail. Basically, every single nickel and dime you get it has to go into a vehicle you get used. Yeah, and the good thing about the uh, that Phantom when you do when you do buy it, it does come with an extra props, you know. So that was a, that was a good thing there, Chris. You take care, Legendary Explorer. Thank you very much for coming in, bud. Five subscribers. Look how many subscribers. Oh, you got hotter than heck over there. The video looked good though that you did, Heath. I like that one. No, they have those sections uh, just for uh, RCing out there and everything, or. I like the way they had those cutouts in the ground, though. Yeah, definitely smash that like button. <laughs> Guess the one thing I got to get now, I got to get more, um, more uh, thumbtacks. So I can hang it up and then just hang it right off the regular hook sections on these. Because I know uh, everything I put up, I always make sure that no holes go in them. And, and the funny thing was, the I don't know why, the doctor asked me today, do you have hobbies? You know, you ever feel depressed, blah, 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 blah. Must be because, you know, uh, a lot of the things that you don't, you know, you can't do when you, you know, you get bad back and everything. They always ask all these questions and stuff now to doctors. And I said, yeah, I said, I got a hobby. I said, I got over 4,000 Hot Wheels. And he goes, well, where do you keep them all? I said, I got them upstairs in my room. You know, I got them in totes. Hot there today. Yeah, those cars that you were showing the other day, they're uh, drone light. Man, those, uh, I believe the two white ones that you were showing, um, were they uh, uh, Dodge Darts? They look like a Dodge Dart by the way the beveled window was, because that's what I had. And I, I couldn't tell or not. No, I'm going to be getting the parts uh, soon, Heath. Uh, the one board I am going to get, uh, I did find one really, really cheap. Um, on Craigslist guy had told his, but the board is okay for only 25 bucks. That's really damn good. Um, so he's going to hold on to it and then I'll go down and I'll buy it. So that wasn't bad. Oh, it wasn't a dart. Oh yeah. Cause those two went, those, those first two that you were showing off, I wasn't sure if that was a dart or not. Cause, uh, usually with those beveled windows in the back like that, either the Plymouth Valiant, the Dodge dart. I mean, they're almost the same kind of by, uh, automobiles usually had those beveled windows and i wasn't sure if uh if that's what it was or not i did like that 57 though 56 or 57 bill if bill saw that he would have loved that you gotta turn that turn that down honey because it'll 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 echo yeah you gotta turn that down honey so it doesn't echo but uh but yeah it uh there was a lot of nice cars that they had sitting there can't believe you're just sitting there though i mean yeah, they need some work, but man, I wouldn't mind working on those. I know Bill that's got that 56, uh, 56 Chevy. I bet you he would have fallen in love with that one there, that red one. Now your daughter, your daughter, your, uh, yeah, your daughter. <laughs> your doctor asked you the same stuff there, uh, Roger. I don't know what it is with doctors asking that crap for. I don't, it's just, procedure i don't know it, it it's got to be something that they they like doing or whatever but that's it's weird they do it here well i know the nurse whatever that talks to you first ask you like all these questions like how is your depression between one and ten and you're like what and then all these other stuff and i don't know maybe they're trying you know, like you said roger trying to push pills on you or something yeah, they basically read the same book over and over again. Who are you trying to do? Follow her over there? <laughs> but yeah, um, try not all different sandpapers I got. I got a whole bunch of different. No, you don't. No, you use wet sandpaper on automobiles. 
Not, not a wood. <laughs> Questions kids will ask you. In bed with um, Roger Martin. <laughs> um, don't unblow blocks with me. I can't. Oh, heat since you're on. I got to show you something. I don't know if I showed you or not. Let me take this stuff inside because I do not want it to get ruined. But uh, the... Um, I'll shut the door here for a second. That uh, that 144 piece puzzle that I was showing you there that I put together, that Darth Vader one, I had uh, Mona Dark um, paint. And that, I don't know if I sent you that one picture, but that thing was so cool when I got done with it. I mean, yeah, it was all black, but the uh, spray painted it with the uh, Mona Dark paint. I mean, this thing glows so bright. It's not even funny. I mean, I showed you that one picture of how it turned out, but that thing was so cool when I got done with it. I was like, oh, man, that was that was really cool. I was glad that it came out really good, too. Raymond, how are you doing, buddy? Thank you very much for coming in. Now I'm trying to cover up with my thumb being in the way. Yeah, the black was cool onto it, but I was like... um. I wanted to, uh, it's a little breezy as I come around the corner. Where'd the kids go? Janae, where are you? Oh, you're over there? Okay. But, uh, yeah, just, uh, being outside as much as possible today. My gosh, it's so beautiful out. I did get the lawn mow, but he's going to bring over some grass seed for where that big section of where the plow destroyed the lawn. As you can see, I mean, there was huge piles, though, from, you know, everything was all just major piles of stuff that come off from over here. You know, I mean, a lot of it come off the, the driveway and everything. It just, uh, Dakota was using a blacktop blade. So everything that was in the driveway became out in the lawn, plus the lawn got uh, dug right up pretty good. But uh, nothing major, you know, stuff that can get fixed. <laughs> I know it. I'm going to hold it in my hand. People go by, wonder what the hell's the matter with me. I have to turn my hand sideways going, I'm flying my drone, give me alone. I ain't got right. <laughs> People probably want to stop taking pictures. You okay? <laughs> I'm like, no, it's broke. Shut up. Leave me alone. My, no, you're, oh, probably did. Which part of the lawn do you think she chewed up first? That way over there, probably. <laughs> no, she was probably out back. She's the one who dug all that up, probably. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the uh, these panels, I think there's still one way out in the field. Um landlord's one son i don't know what he was going to do with these but these are all those you know like if you got a big cooler walk-in cooler or whatever all them panels well that one day we had a humongous storm that ended up way over in the field and uh i don't know if they grabbed it or not there was two sheets missing there was one way over uh one over there that i seen when i was flying like two weeks ago two or three weeks ago and I seen it was out there, but unless they brought them back, but I don't, I don't see them out here yet because these are the same ones they had for a while. But I'm gonna fire up the parrot rolling spider drone. Awesome, but I'll definitely watch that. That's why he needs to make a hat cam. Definitely, I, I got plenty of hats, so you know, I have to break out my drill and make a hole and. Then put the thing through it so I can hold my phone. No, my luck, I'll make it. And then all of a sudden I turn my head and it'll probably fall off. I got duct tape. That'll work. <laughs> How to make a redneck uh, phone holder for your hat. <laughs> Tons of tape. But, yeah. Um, I know they haven't done this field quite yet. Oh, it's way over there now. Well, when we had that uh, that storm and everything, use a knife. That's right. <laughs> I got tons of knives. I might have to do that. I see the one is missing, but there's one way over there that uh, 
but the one that was over here they must have grabbed it or something i don't see it unless they threw it over by the woods but there's one way over there one of those panels because they've only done uh you know just this small section right here around and they haven't hit the the inner field quite yet I have to make a video of that <laughs> that's right red green show you remember if you if you don't spare if you don't spare the duct tape spoil the job and remember if the women don't find you handsome they'll sure find you handy <laughs> i miss watching that show i used to love watching the red green show possum lodge i don't know if any of you ever watched that but i used to love watching the red green show have a hat cam but never used it i know how they they have all different ones out i guess that you can screw one in or they have the one that's already mounted or they have the one that has the gopro don't need the gopro one i'll just put a stick through a damn hat and duct tape to it <laughs> as long as you can still see through the the cameras you're doing good i live on a farm i'll call it the farmer's cop job red, redneck intuition <laughs> so oh no wait being i'm on a farm i'll have to use some bailing twine and bailing twine, a uh, piece of wood, and that's probably all I'll need. <laughs> that ought to work good for me. <laughs> Somewhere down the line, I don't know if they have a patent for that one. <laughs> but yeah, he's uh, going to be picking up some more grass seed. Uh, so that way we can reseed all this because it needs it. Um, half of it uh got seeded um he only had a small little bag so i'll have to see uh i know he was going to pick up another bag uh, a bigger bag just to see because i know it needs a lot of it throughout here here um hopefully the wind ain't too bad on you guys and a strip of beef turkey that's right after i put that hat together i'd be running around going i need some red fried potatoes mm -hmm. How much you want for the bacons? <laughs> Somebody asked me that the other day. They were like, can you do that voice? I was like, eh, a little bit. And the, who the heck was it? Shit, I can't remember. I think it was my cousin. End up setting up one of me on a log. Does it work well? We'll go, uh, oh, it doesn't work good? Oh, boy. A strip of beef jerky. Gotta have the beef jerky. <laughs> Teriyaki beef jerky. Usually I like the moist ones. The moist uh, beef jerky. The two dried out ones. I don't know what it is. I just I just like the ones that are has more uh, more juice to them. One and uh, so I'll have to uh, get good shots of them when they do going out. But I'm gonna. Wait until they grow out really, really well. Um, I want to basically till this all up. I want to put a, uh, a fountain in here, um, someplace over here, but I mean, I want to take all the stones out. I did put in my uh, um, my one uh, solar light. I got that out here. But usually I have more out here, but, uh, you know, I want to get this all cleaned out been so busy with all their stuff and then being sick and doing the exorcist uh hurling i think i was going for distance so but uh but yeah um just going to be working on the uh, uh that railing uh until uh i gotta see i think he was supposed to be bringing up a paintbrush because i want to do all that over too windy on the fly it's too windy out so thank you very much for coming in how are you doing today kentucky hillbilly engineer for life what you up to bud i didn't see no tow truck or crane show up were you stopping up second tuesday of next week <laughs> i think i brought out lighter it don't work too well but yeah i took the the uh, turtle well it's not called turtle i don't know what the heck this name is on this brand um can right no car right that's the name of it i don't know if anybody's ever heard of those that's the name of that one 
car right. It's all plastic. But uh, yeah, he had it down in the cellar and junk day was going on. So I was helping him uh, take a lot of stuff down to, to uh, throw out, take it down to the, the dump. And he's like, I don't really use it at all. I've used it maybe once or twice. He says, do you want it? Yeah, I can use that. It was good for camping. You put the tent in there, put all the sleeping bags and everything else in the, and those things were good for it. That's why I like those things. Although I do remember the, uh, you guys remember the old turtle that go on top? My dad used to have one of them on a station wagon. That definitely looked like the family Griswold truckster. <laughs> Didn't have the same color, but father had, I don't know how many different station wagons. One was uh, the uh, Chevy Caprice classic station wagon. Uh, a couple of other ones. Always had the third row seat way in the back. Yeah, this one flies good in the in the wind once I get it back up and running again. All these damn nice days going by, I'm just like, <sighs> fun. Unless I throw my phone up in the air, that's probably about the best photo I'm going to get up in the air. <laughs> Every bird they have came in the wind. All the time making excuses not to fly. <laughs> <laughs> What's everybody doing in there? Watch the cartoon. See, I talk too much, man. Light, uh, my, <laughs> I almost said my lighter went out, but it's actually my phone. She's over here. See, look, she's back out again. Hi. How are you guys? Is up no good? I am not. You're always bothering people. Get out of here. No, I'm okay with you. That's classified. I only do that on days and end in why I remember that now. <laughs> you guys to win is my excuse. Fine. I only mess with them because I'm all about doing the same. Like we all do that. It's like, yeah, we look outside and it's like beautiful out. And then we're like, well, we're doing other stuff. And it's like, how come you didn't go out fly today? Ah, it was windy and I didn't want to take it out. It was too damn windy out. I think it looked like it was going to rain. 700 miles away from me here. So, you know, I, I didn't want to take it out. <laughs> yeah, the escape goat. Crimson Art, how are we doing, buddy? Thank you very much for coming in. I hope you're having a good day today. I look rough, man. I'm outside doing stuff and everything else. Because of crash, I had no money to get another one. Or repair. Exactly. Oh, oh yeah. In state cost less. Yeah. I didn't even have to go far with mine. All I did was take off with it, but lawnmower versus rock versus drone versus, oh shit, I'm screwed kind of deal. <laughs> but it wasn't his fault. I mean, you know, things happen and it wasn't on the ground and I had extra blades, thank God. Camera's all right and everything else like that, but. Thank you, Martin. We love our birds too much to risk them. That's right. And believe me, if something does happen, you, it's almost like your car gets hit. Believe me. When I did that out here, I was like, my face was like, oh, I remember throwing my hat. That's all I remember is throwing my hat. And I know a lot of words were saying. Love you, Heath. Thank you very much for coming out, bud. I hope you have a good day and a good night, buddy. Six hundred thirty-three feet. You know, would your battery dying before you got it down on the ground, Chris? Kim, Kim's in the house. Hey, Kim, what are you up to, buddy? Oh, just just trying to get it to land on the on the table. What are you up to today, Kim? Yeah, it's funny too. I was talking to a doctor about no sleep deals again, and all I ever hear from him is, "Oh, well, you know, try not doing this at night, and blah blah this, and do that." And I'm like, "It don't work. I tried it." And I'm like, "He's like, well, how come you don't do the uh, doubling up on the gamma pet?" And I told him, I said, 
uh, A, it makes my uh, heartbeat go bad out of hell, which I don't need that. And you start breathing heavier, and he says, oh, well, yeah, don't definitely don't do that. Ooh, Tammy, how are you doing, Tammy? Thank you very much for coming in. I hope you're having a wonderful day as well. Yeah, I guess so in his damn eye ever since then. It's like bothered me. Oh. No, I'm glad you're having a good time there. Messing up a new tablet for my flying phantom. Oh no, what'd you do to it? Oh, we're oh yeah. And usually when you hit a railing, that uh, equals oh crap. Well, worse words. Doing well there, Tammy. Doing well. What the hell? They come up into the porch here and then took off. I was like, Jesus, where are they going? Yeah, I look tired as hell. Look like I got more wrinkles than I should around my eyes. Oh, the Samsung Galaxy tablet. How do you like that one? Is that pretty good, Kim? Kelly, she's inside. I'm outside where it's nice. I got to sand down the rest of the porch railing that we put together over here. I'll show you. Oh, I hit the right button. I mean, we got the uh, that one step uh, cemented in down there, but uh, we put it in the railing and everything. So I got to do some sanding and everything. Get it all smoothed out really well before painting because I want to paint the, the porch all over because it desperately needs it. Whoever painted it before did not do a good job. So I want to repaint the whole porch over because it desperately needs it on the walls and everything. I would rather hit it with a pressure washer. So that way, uh, that way it looks a hell of a lot better. Making hamburgers and antipasto. Antipasta? Is that what you're trying to say? You got Kellyitis. Antipasto. Is that like your Depeche mode? It's actually said Depeche mode. I still pick on her about that. <laughs> She's probably in there going, kick the hell out. <laughs> Love you, honey. <laughs> 10 inch RCA Viking. Need something a little bit bigger? <laughs> Shut up, Douglas. Kiss my hand. Love you. Being married so much fun. <laughs> Bacon and eggs with pancakes for supper tonight. Oh, Jesus. I'll be right over, Roger. Let me get in the car. I'll be right there in a second. <laughs> Sounds good. Shit. Put bacon and top the hamburger, eggs on the side, maybe inside there underneath. That would be real good. <laughs> Didn't have the ump, did it, Kim? Breakfast for dinner is always awesome. Yeah. Wi-Fi, the controller. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, right about now, basically eggs, sausage, and bacon... I don't know. Sa the round sausage. The sausage links are good, but the round bacon, you go to some diners and you get those round ones. I don't know what it is. They always taste good, whatever, with the bacon and eggs. That's always good. Linked it right up. Oh, okay. That's good. Yes, please. I'll take one slice there, honey. Swiss cheese it. Oh, Jesus. Was that the plastic chair? All of a sudden, the leg went. Like, All of a sudden, one cheek got fat ass. I just. <laughs> Jimmy Dean sausage. Oh, yeah. Smash that like button down below. I can't even do it right. I'm like. <laughs> Don't break your ass now. I know. I'd be like at a doctor's once and next, you know, I'll be back again going, what happened to you? I broke my ass. I hit the concrete. <laughs> Eggs over easy, yolk goes, yeah. Because it's always good when you have the sausage with that and everything. Got to have the bread, you know, nice and crisp, butter on top. I don't know. I always like slice mine uh, down the middle so it just gushes out. Put it on the bread, eat it like a sandwich, and then use the yolk for the sausage and the bacon. Oh, boy. Where the hell did you get that truck from? That would be my brother. 
Who'd you steal that truck from? Oh, your boss's truck? Look, I got pretty railing. Nice Ford F-350. You're leaving out here, right? God oh, damn, how many bugs has he hit? A lot. I can say. Hey, look. It's Sasquatch. What are you doing? <laughs> Not much. Just doing a live show. What are you doing? I'm on my way to pick up parts for a skitch there. Oh, what did you do? Break skitch there? No. It was broken when he bought it. Oh, you just bought one? How size did you get? What? What size is it? Uh, 190. Oh, ain't that. Nothing, nothing. Nothing. Where are you running to pick that up? Oh, well, maybe I know where you come back over this way. Yeah. All right, I'll go take the tail away, honey. I'm gonna be running with you. Yeah, let's say that over again. That was a Doug Addis moment. I was like, <laughs> going with my brother, and then I'll be right back. We're going down to Clinton Tractor. He's got to get the uh skid steer, but don't worry, I'll be back to have that burger. Burger. Got him a burger. But, uh, yes, Drone Life, thank you very much. Um, they're going to go up on the wall. They're going to be right next to the other ones. Uh, love all you guys. Thank you very much for coming on here. And, uh, like I